Hello, I'm at East Paulding Middle School today in the Media Center. And for those of you who have not had an opportunity to visit East Paulding Middle School's Media Center, it just truly is a hub of learning. Uh, we're here today in a corner set aside for collaboration for students or with students. Marker boards behind us that they can use as they work together, but there's a green screen room, a maker space, a 3D printer, and so many of the types of instructional materials that go along and align with STEM education. It's just a great place to be and to visit. And I'm here today with Morgan Cochran. Morgan teaches seventh grade science here at East Paulding Middle School. Morgan, do you have any questions about SPLOST? I do. I was wondering what types of things can the eSPLOST dollars be used for? That's an amazing question, and I just happen to have the answer right here. Uh, East Bloss dollars can be used for capital projects. Examples of those would be the construction of new schools, adding classrooms to existing facilities, renovating and modifying existing uh, schools, athletic facilities, tennis courts, tracks, gyms, etc. School buses, technology in the forms of computer and networking equipment, curricular materials such as textbooks, and of course fine arts equipment. So again, SPLOS dollars are used for capital projects. Morgan, great question, and thank you so much for all you do for our students.